case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1976, a familial dispute over land ownership led to a case heard by the Supreme Court of New Mexico, Romero v. Garcia. The controversial trial spotlighted Ida Romero, once tied by marriage to the Garcias, who initiated a lawsuit against her former in-laws, Mr. and Mrs. Antonio Garcia. The bone of contention was a piece of land whose deed was invalidated due to a missing signature. Despite the defective deed, Romero professed rightful ownership of the property, contending she held it in adverse possession for over a decade, maintaining the essential requirement of tax payment throughout. However, the Garcias rebuffed Romero's claim, demanding robust, compelling proof to validate her controversial stance. Another complication was the property's ambiguous description as 13 acres more or less, which raised questions about its exact boundaries. With extrinsic evidence such as testimonies and the plaintiff's identification, a surveyor was able to overcome this boundary ambiguity, proving the dimensions were slightly less than the vaguely mentioned 13 acres. To add credibility to Romero's claim, the court also acknowledged the continuous payment of taxes by Romero. The Supreme Court upheld the original trial's firm judgment. It asserted that the plaintiff's identification and subsequent actions effaced lingering boundary uncertainties. Furthermore, the court declared that the extrinsic evidence gathered had been necessary to locate the land correctly, a vital factor if one were to claim it in adverse possession. Lastly, the rigorous payment of taxes by the plaintiff sufficed for the adverse possession condition. However, the judgment wasn't unanimous with Justice Stevenson dissenting and Justice Montoya abstaining from participation. The case sets a potent precedent for possession disputes, reminding parties that thorough evidence can override even an invalidated deed. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsc.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.